Okay, y'all, welcome to another vlog. It's been like maybe two days or so since I've recorded. I haven't recorded for, I, I think it's been two days. I'm um, still editing the next vlog. I just uploaded the last one, I think maybe a day or two ago. But just to give y'all a recap, of the last two days that I haven't vlogged, I've been pretty much um, chilling. I guess you could say I took like some self-care days without the camera. I just been chilling, resting, cause um, we don't do homeschool with Madison on Friday. So that was a day to chill, kind of relax, catch up on some rest. And then um, later that evening, we went to a um, home buyers event and then after that of course Madison and Kona um, to that she was with the grandparents and then um, let me see what I do yesterday I'm chilling yesterday too but I got like some emails and stuff done for my business and planning more pieces for the spring collection because spring is right around the corner but yeah i guess you could say i took some uh mental health days i ain't had no breakdown but i just needed time to chill so that's what i did no camera no nothing i actually also um like took time to do like some admin work and um, went through all my emails and stuff like that. I have, I got like, including Madison's email, I think I got like five, five or six email mailboxes that I look at every week. Yeah, so today the plan is to shoot some content for not only Instagram, but TikTok, YouTube Shorts, blog, of course, and get that stuff geared up for the next couple days. Um, we're going to a friend's um, birthday get together later. We're gonna be going bowling. That's at 7.30. Madison ditched us um, after we went to the event on um, Friday for the home buying stuff. She wanted to spend a night with the grandparents, so she did. And then she had a play date yesterday with her cousin while she was with the grandparents. So of course, she got her another night in um, to spend the night over there. I'm using this new case on my phone. And I'm gonna eventually show it to y'all, but obviously it's on my phone, so I can't show you at this very moment. But it's helping me be able to vlog with the back camera because a lot of times, although I know that, um, bro, go ahead and brush my teeth again. But yeah, I know that I'm supposed to always use the back camera. A lot of times I find myself using the front facing camera because it's just easier and it's quicker and you can see yourself and you just keep it pushing. But I know I'm not supposed to, so let me brush my teeth right there. scraper and I know most people they rinse their mouth with all the water but you're really not supposed to because at that point you're literally rinsing off all that fluoride and stuff that protects your teeth and your enamel and stuff so I suggest you just go ahead and rinse with your mouthwash and this is the mouthwash I'm using that is going to conclude this portion of the vlog like I said I'll be back after my bath, I'm not gonna get any bath content today because it's gonna be just a nice, relaxing, quick midday bath. And so, yep, yeah, stay tuned and I'll see y'all in a little bit. All right, y'all, we are headed to the um, bowling alley now. I did not get a chance to show y'all what I got on.
because I'm on that hoe. What's up, y'all? It is Monday. It's three fifty-two in the afternoon. I'm headed to go pick us up. I guess a, a late lunch. I'm headed to Chick Fil A because I was about to make lunch. I had sent out like some chicken. And I sent out some ground turkey, but I didn't really have a plan. I thought about um, making some like lemon butter chicken or something like that. I was like, this don't take too long. So if anything, I'll do that for dinner. But I'm definitely not doing that for. Um, for lunch i wanted something quick so i was like i'm gonna go to chick-fil-a give me some strips some fries milkshakes all of us getting some milkshakes because that's just what we on today but yeah so yesterday i did not get a chance to show y'all what i wore to the bowling alley because once i got home i was ready to get comfortable and i completely forgot that i was supposed to do my um video to show y'all what i was wearing or whatever so i ended up of course taking those clothes off and getting comfortable and all of that and then i took my butt on to bed y'all supposed to do that and it was something else i was supposed to do i don't even remember yeah, so once we got home i got comfortable and went on about my business but today for sure i'll be finishing up editing the next vlog yeah you gotta stop but yeah today for sure I'll finish um, editing the vlog that's coming up next. Okay, so I'm at Chick-fil-A. Let me get to me a, um, a designated parking spot and I'll check back in with y'all in just a minute. All right, I'll let them know that I'm here. I'm just waiting on my food now. Sorry. For Princess? Yes. Here you go. Thank you. My pleasure. Have a great day. You too. Walked up quick. I'm over here making sure everything in my backpack is straight. All right, y'all. I got this food. So I'm about to head back to the house, of course, eat and then finish editing the next vlog and be productive. I took my little old midday uh, bath in um, Chick-fil-A, but I'm still going to make sure everything is. All right, but yeah, I took my little midday bath, and instead of putting on regular clothes, I uh, went to the laundry room and grabbed my gown since it was clean. So I was like, let me be comfortable instead of um, wasting the outfit to run up here to Chick-fil-A knowing I ain't getting out the car. This milkshake is feeling a little bit. But all right, y'all. I'll see y'all back at the house when I check in once I'm done eating and stuff. How can I lose if I'm already chose? Like, if she's feeling hot, then I'm like, that was frozen. I get up and say every time that I pose. Damn. Hey, y'all. I am out headed to Kroger. I put in a Kroger pickup order um, earlier today. And so I'm headed to pick that up now. I'm actually late. <laughs> After that little me going early incident last time, I was like, I'm not about to rush up there and my stuff don't be ready. But I'm like 45 minutes to an hour behind time as far as the time that I picked to pick it up. And the lady actually called me and was making sure I was still coming. So I told her that I was uh, headed that way. But yes, yeah, so I'm picking up this uh, Kroger order and then I'm going to take it back home because we got some freezer items in the order that I don't want to melt. Any other time I would have made my um, other stops first and then came to Kroger last but as you can see I'm already late so I'm like I don't want them to put my whole order back because that's going to save me some time with that already being ready. So I'm about to go pick this up and then um, go back home drop the groceries off and then get Madison because she wanted to roll to a Target with me. I don't know if Chris rolled it tonight. I don't think he is. But, uh, yeah. Get Madison because she wanted to roll to Target with me because I want to go to Target because I came across this video maybe a week or so ago on Instagram where it was basically saying a lot of the essential oils and these different scented products that we use not only on ourselves but on our kids are uh, endocrine 
disruptors i believe i said that correctly endocrine disruptors and so basically what it does is it not only messes with our bodies just overall but it's messing with our hormones or whatever and for kids it's causing them to develop earlier so there was this two two year old little girl and it was causing her to develop very very early she was literally two years old and i don't remember exactly what um had the endocrine disruptors in it that she was using well that her mom and dad were using on her but i want to say it was some hair products possibly well anyway i had scanned some of uh madison's products in her bathroom because i'm like let me see what we got up in this house or whatever and her deodorant being one of them and a lot of these deodorants even if they're aluminum free because we all use aluminum free deodorant even when the deodorants are aluminum free y'all they still have some of those ingredients that are endocrine disruptors which are messing with our hormones not only our kids but us too as adults so you might want to go ahead and look into the ingredients that's in these products that you're using an easy way to do it is to get the yucca app is y-u-k-a and then if not getting that app then just look up each ingredient yourself you know do a google search or whatever but yeah i just wanted to make y'all aware so that's the main reason we're going to target we're going to be going to to basically replace the deodorant that we have at the house for Madison because like I said all of our deodorants are aluminum free and we thinking oh yeah we're good we're using this and it's organic blah 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 but like a lot of these essential oils and some of these other chemicals and stuff that's in these deodorants the, not deodorants these deodorants and lotions and stuff like that y'all better look into these ingredients I'm not even playing be back y'all let me let them know I'm here Hello. Pickups for Princess Dujan. Yes. Do you have any paper coupons? No. Oh uh, yeah, that's fine. Thank you. All right, y'all. So I am now headed back to the house so that I can drop off these groceries and then me and Madison will head to Target. And now that I think about it, we're actually going to be making two store runs, not only to Target but also to Albertsons because I believe I already told y'all these last couple times that we have hit up Target. The fruit has not been A1. And you know, fruit already going bad quick, especially when you get it organic. So for it to be looking bad when you go to get it, I'm not getting it. So I'm not going to do a Central Market run today or Market Street or nothing like that. I'm going to just go to Albertsons because Albertsons fruit is usually pretty decent. So I'm headed to the house now and then I will check back in with y'all once we get to Target. I just not hold them groceries over in the back. It sounded bad. I'm about to upload this like I ain't even gonna hold y'all. <laughs> that sounded so bad. I'm about to just get out here and take my chance.
I'm the pusher. <laughs> you wanted me to put you so bad, you should have said something. <laughs> Sorry guys, we'll be right back. That's better? Yeah. Okay. Her head was just oh, cut off. Excuse me, I'm sorry. Oh no, oh, she's sorry, fine. No, you. no, you did it. I was sorry. just in the way. <laughs> You're good. But we got the water. We got the uh deodorant. Ooh. What else I said? I said some coffee. Let me push. Push into nobody. Oh, I can push into you. This one is for the boys with the booming system. Top town AC with the coolest system. When you come up in the club, you be Okay, hold on. You're stopping me. I can't go. This is me. This is a cute Oh, with the pockets. Okay. Oh, that's cute. Mm -hmm. I like this. It's cute. Turn around. It looks thin. Look at this. Yeah, like you can see through it. Yeah, that's too thin. We ain't getting it. But that's thin. You know. No, that's thin. That's thin. <laughs> like, bruh. This is a cute little squirt. Oh, wait a minute. I found a cute summer outfit. All right, y'all. We just left up out of Target. We got the Lume deodorant. This is the cream deodorant because for whatever reason, um, when we scanned the regular stick deodorant, the app told us that they were working on a new formulation. And so the old formulation, I guess, still has some trash ingredients in it because when we scanned the cream, the cream came up as excellent, but the stick deodorant came up as trash so we went ahead and went with the cream deodorant for madison um this is the clean tangerine invisible cream one it says 72 hour odor control so we'll be testing this out tonight after she takes her bath and then me and chris will probably transition to uh, this brand as well but yeah everything else that we scanned that was aluminum free was trash it came up as poor with a score of like less than 50 so i didn't want to risk any of those other brands so this is what we're going with and i'll give y'all a review as we continue to use it throughout the next couple days with her and i'm sure she'll let us know if she like it too and besides the deodorant all we got was some spring water we wanted you know bottled water because we got caramel water with the kroger pickup earlier Oh, she got hers. But yeah, we got some caramel water with our Kroger pickup earlier. And we normally do bottles of spring water if we don't do alkaline water. So we got that since nobody seems to have like the 12 or 24 packs of spring water for whatever reason. So now we are headed to Albertson's so we can get our fruit and go home so I can start on dinner. And also, it was this really cute summer outfit, but she said next time. Yeah, because we didn't come to do spring and summer clothes shopping. That ain't what I'm here for. I'm trying to get in and get out. Bye. <laughs> All right, y'all. It is that way now. Feel up when I like it. Comfort in my sense. And all about me. All it got right now. All right, y'all. We just finished up in Albertsons. We got some grapes. <laughs> we did not get bananas because we saw some nets flying around them. And next, mm mm. We do not need a net infestation at the house at all. It started out with one, then next thing you know, you got 50 of them bad boys zooming around your house. So we left the bananas. So we'll probably go to a different store, if not tomorrow, um, one of the days coming up this week, 
and get some bananas and they didn't have any strawberries so i'm assuming strawberries are bad right now they had some watermelon but it just wasn't looking like real red and sweet to me so i did not get any watermelon from here either so we just went with the grapes and we just gonna leave it at that so if anything if we pop back out tomorrow it's supposed to rain so maybe not but if at any point we pop back out tomorrow we'll go to a store that has a better selection of fruit and we'll keep it pushing from there. So we're about to head back to the house so I can get started on dinner. And then we'll knock out baths and showers and we'll be done for the night. And I'll probably go ahead and uh, shoot some content that I've been meaning to shoot for like the last two or three days. Earlier today wasn't the day. It wasn't the time for me to do it. So yeah. So I'm going to go home, get dinner going, like I said. And then we'll knock out showers and baths and we'll probably chill out for the rest of the night. See y'all at the house. All right, y'all. This is the lemon butter garlic chicken or whatever. And then these are the little um, rolls. Put some garlic butter on there, some Kerrygold garlic butter on there. I already showed y'all the mac and cheese. But yeah, this is the finished product. I'm pretty much done. I'm about to put the rolls back in for a few more minutes so that butter can kind of seep in the dough and then I'll be done. All right, y'all. It's been a few days. Um, this is what I'm wearing today. We're about to go to an indoor water park for uh, my little cousin's birthday party. So this is my swimsuit. This is what I call my uh, mom <laughs> swimsuit because I'm still covered. I have these shorts and this is a um, one piece swimsuit. So these are not the shoes I'm wearing. These are actually my slippers. I'll be wearing my Crocs just to keep it simple and uh, quick for me to uh, take on and off. So yeah, this is the swimsuit. Like I said, it's a one piece and I'll link it in my uh, Amazon store because I've had it for at least a year. So I had it when Madison was taking swim lessons. And then my hair, we did that. And then I'm done today. I'm gonna try not to go underwater because I don't wanna have to wash my hair tonight. But if it happens, it happens and I'll just deal with it when we get back. But yeah, like I said, headed to the water park. We actually have to run by Target real quick. So I might take y'all in there with us master has on her swimsuit too but i'll have to show y'all that later because she is in her room yeah this is the final look and i have on my hot pink crocs or magenta crocs whatever color they are see y'all shortly Alright y'all, I got the gift but I forgot my tripod so I'm about to end the video shortly. <laughs> Canvas. Y'all like Ariana if they ever tryna knock up Put my foot up and y'all talk I call your mama and your papa 
it like I'm finna take a dollar Turn that bitch into a sack of ball and rock a rock a rock a Get into it like a suit and fuck a stack of like a rock a